So we've just taken our regional homogeneity maps and normalized them using tools like 3D Calc, some other 3D and 1D tools within AFNI. Now we can do the, basically the same thing in FSL, and to do that we just need to port everything into a format that FSL understands, such as a .nifty format. And then do some operations using FSL tools, and then port it back into AFNI format if you want. Uh, nifty is also read in by AFNI, so you could keep it in that format as well. The reason you might want to do this is because it can be easier to do batching when you're using some FSL commands, when you can put things into certain variables, do some operations, and then have the thing continue to run. Uh, there might also be a way to do it using this normalization procedure I've just outlined, but I haven't figured out how to do it yet. I'm kind of lazy, but I'm also going to make the excuse that this will give you some additional tools and some other ways of thinking about how you can interact with and manipulate your data. So first things first, what we need to do is convert our AFNI data to Nifty format. And we're going to do that for the regional homogeneity data set that we created. And we're also going to do that with our group mask for reasons which I will discuss presently. Okay, so now both of those are in Nifty format. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to now, as we did before, calculate the mean and the standard deviation across all of the voxels within that mask. Okay. So I'm going to call this one mean reho. And I'm going to put into that variable the output from FSL stats, reho test mask.nai, and a big M. Big M, that option just means only do this calculation for non-zero voxels. I echo what's in mean reho. It's 0.568, which is basically the same thing that I got with AFNI. I'm going to do a similar thing with standard deviation. I'm going to call this variable standard deviation reho. Again, FSL stats, reho. God. Thanks. Okay, reho test mask. And a big capital S, which means only do this for non zero voxels. Voxels which don't have a zero in them. In other words, only do this stuff within the whole brain mask. Okay, and again, this value is very similar to what we got before. And now that we have that, we can use both of those to calculate a normalized regional homogeneity map. Now to do this, we're going to use FSL maths, similar to 3D calc. Okay, we're going to input this reho test mask nifty file. We're going to subtract the mean reho variable and divide by SD reho. Oops, STD reho. Yes, and we're going to multiply this by our mask, which is maskgroup.nii. And let's call this output a reho norm. Okay, once we've done that, uh, simply just check to make sure that it does in fact exist. It should have a .nii.gz extension. And really that's all we need. And you just can gun zip it. And if you want, put it back into AFNI format. Oops, which I guess I already had because I was testing this before I was doing this. Okay. Okay, great. And notice that this is pretty much, it should be identical to what we had before. Okay, great. So that's how you do it with FSL, and as you can see, because we have things in variables, we could easily put that into a batch file. Now, that just involves some additional steps using that with FSL, but you can kind of see the point in how these two things transfer between each other. So I hope that helps, and maybe it'll become useful in the future.